anyway, hello everybody. Welcome to Pro Tips Wood Elves, game number 10. Um, against Norse. <laughs> My bogey team, the Norse. Uh, if we're, oh, he, I think he's good, I can has cheeseburger. If we're even TV, this would be a horrible matchup. As it is, he does have a lineman with dirty player, so he will. And he might have his Cheney as well, mightn't he? So it might be interesting, but this would be this would be a bad matchup if we were equal TV. And uh, this just could be bad. Yeah, sometimes you get people taking Morgan instead. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Yeah, Norse, sad times. He might get Morg, mightn't he? And he might just get nothing and concede. That would be great. That's true, Hibby, yeah, that's true. I would say high TV, it would favour Wood Elves. And low TV, it would favour Wood Elves. But, <laughs> no, sorry, low TV, it would favour Norse. High TV, it would favour Wood Elves. But the fact that I'm high TV and he's low TV makes it interesting. Because he, he could get lucky, couldn't he, with a Wizard and Cheney and stuff. But yeah, the TV difference obviously means that I've got just loads more skills than him. And hopefully... Hopefully that's enough. Oh man, is he gonna do what that chalk did? No shit, bribe, fuck. Fuck, no, no bribes, no bribes. Cancel, cancel, get Morgan instead. No bribes, please no bribes. Please. <laughs> Maybe he's gonna take the star player, Snow Troll, to hit the tree. Come on, run out of time. Run out of time. No! No, you fuck. Okay, it did run out of time anyway. He didn't get a third bribe. That's something. Yeah, okay, I guess I guess the win the it would always favour what else winning even at low TV, but I don't know, I, don't know, I think at a thousand TV it might favour the Norse. At a thousand, but um, you know the fact that he's got frenzy to hit your dodge guys gives him more weapons than most, doesn't it? He did feel a need a handicap, yeah. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. That guy with the chops, man. Oh man, that guy with the chops took no no inducements and proceeded to to murder me like nobody ever has before or since mm. this is not a great sade formation is it <laughs> you on the bench <laughs> It's so good that you don't even have your best player on the pitch half the time. He doesn't have short hands, does he? So you can always roll some dice to get the ball off him. We do this to limit his frenzy. Does he even have frenzy? Yeah, he's got he's got an ulfs. He's got an ulf there. I don't uh, I need the skill ones. I can't tell them apart. Berserkers, two berserkers, and an ulf. He's got dauntless as well, hasn't he? Cheerfire to hit the war dancers, and they've got bludge. That'll do me. I 
I'm guessing on one hand you could frenzy them into further chain, chains or further blocks or whatever, but I think it makes blocking these, getting multiple blocks on the OS risky. Undead are about as good as Woody's at low TV, yeah, that's true. The team that does the best against Woody's in NAF style is Dwarves. Yep, exactly J5, yeah. Definitely fucked. Could be attrition fireball on five players, yeah. I'd be okay if he concedes, to be fair. I'll always take a concession victory. Emma. Is this a fash diamond? <laughs> nah, this is just a uh, trying to mess with frenzy a bit formation. Fash diamond is the chevron or the ziggurat. Oh, yes, a six man fireball, not even a five man fireball, yeah. Gone for the attrition fireball. Oh god. Badly hurt, fine. <laughs> I mean, it's, to be fair, it's a good use of the inducement money. Um, like, in terms of levelling the playing field, I guess he gets to foul the. Uh, Foul the tree with the bribes, but it's not good for winning the game, is it? Oh yeah, I mean it worked out for him, but I just think it was a bad decision, you know? I, th I do think it was a bad decision, although it worked out. Although it worked out for him getting the fucking badly hurt. The chance of him getting a Kaz is, is obviously low. Yeah, I would definitely buy 150k inducement. <laughs> yeah, that, but that, it wasn't though, was it? You know, if he could buy 150k inducement that said get rid of this player, he would have done it. Obviously I would do it, of course. So he got value from it, but um, I do think it was the wrong decision. It, you know, like, you wouldn't call aces, you wouldn't call an all-in with 2-3, would you? You know? But then, uh, if you won the title, if you won the hand and then won the title because of it, then it worked out. It definitely worked out for him. I mean, if I was desperate to win, I would have appled that, but obviously should be able to win without him anyway, really. And he does have... He does have a... Uh, Bribe, two bribes, and a dirty player. I'm pretty sure he won't be conceding. <laughs> Not after getting the Kaz on the ward, honestly. Yeah, that's the thing. It's. I think you just gain too much from, you know, Wizards being ridiculously powerful. Hmm.
Glorious. Congratulations on stealing fifty dollars from me, you horrible thieving jerk. <laughs> Um, well, thank you very much, Sudan. Um, ten months? Unbelievable, isn't it? Unbelievable. Thank you very much for staying fantastic. Even though I've got four. Yeah, okay, okay. I probably what I should have done was I should have moved him to there. I didn't need this guy here, because he was gonna dodge away. This guy should have been here and he would have been safe, wouldn't he? Now you can just block him and No, no maybe not. <laughs> Thank you very much, Sudan. <laughs> I mean, it's given him it's given him a good advantage for the rest of the game, hasn't it? Taking that guy out, but um, I don't. I think it'd been better using it um, to achieve something <laughs> than than using it to not achieve something. Yeah, that's true. Mana raise, I guess. Yeah, that's true. I guess maybe I shouldn't have made it so attractive for him. But still, I, I would, I will take people with attrition fireballing me every day of the week, because if he cast any other player than the war dancers, and he's only fifty percent to knock them down, and then on like you know only fifty percent to break armor more or less. And then only 50% of KO them. So, you know, he, he got pretty lucky to get a Kaz out of it. Double stun as well, didn't he? Awesome, no. <laughs> that was good. That was good. Is this the blitzer? Yeah, that's annoying because he's got jump up, hasn't he? So. This one as well. Yeah, that's a runner. Okay. Crap, isn't it? GFI, good handoff. Good 
pass. Pass it into the into a cage here. He can jump up block here, but he still doesn't break. Uh, all right, don't fail me now, tree man. Good lad. All right, not bad. Got the ball caged up. Maybe I should try to defend the ward on some more. <laughs> Could score a handoff, but it would be it was in two tackle zones. You saw what happened. <laughs> you saw what happened was in one tackle zone before. Yeah, he's going for the foul on the ward answer. Fuck. Hey, jump up fail. Even a two assist foul with a fucking dirty player on armor seven is pretty bad times, isn't it? A lot of zombie. He's talking defence here as he as he abandons the drive to foul. Thanks God. <laughs> can leap to safety now. He can block him. Can actually blitz with uh, blitz a wrestle guy with uh, blitz a block guy with wrestle can't I now, which is a nice. Nice little option to have. One, two, three, four, five, six. GFI, GFI. He's got to do a lot of work to hit us here. Oh shit, he can block us. He should have blocked him. Oh, he couldn't block him. Right, he can abandon ship as well. All right, time for leap number three in the team's lifetime. All right. 
See you later, slugheads. <laughs> that, that actually, if he powers him now, it's it, even bigger gang foul, isn't it? But never mind. Leaping the safety, unbelievable, Jeff. Oh, I didn't even hit the blood, Jeff. Didn't even hit the ward answer. Ah, oh, this way he gets follow up blocked. Fair enough. Still, he, he could have done, couldn't he? He could have, he could have run around here, hit the ward answer twice, and then, uh, and then got another two, and then another two. He could have got eight dice on the ward answer there. He would have dropped him as well. Thank God he didn't. <laughs> it would have been a huge gang foul. Yeah, the first leap was a double score blitz. The second leap was not getting surfed. And this was the third leap, which was not getting fouled. <laughs> so yeah, there's been two leaps to safety. And one leap into a double skull on the ball. <laughs> huge, huge foul now, isn't it? Unfortunately, this fouling could kind of maybe win in the game, couldn't it? Just by... And this fucking stupid attrition whiz. Let's just get a block in. Fucking rough. He can get served, can't he? One, two, three, four, five, six, Giovanni, not really. I was thinking this guy would move. I was going to save him as well by going to here, but then... The, what, don't, don't, the ward answer there could then get hit. Maybe here. Maybe here's alright, actually. And the ward answer goes there. Fuck 
fucking hell. Grim this. <laughs> You're just making an armor break, a guaranteed armor break, and then an injury with plus one every single turn is not good, is it? This is like, you know, this is... This couldn't go <laughs> kind of badly wrong. This is the Muldripster's Skaven team uh, strategy, isn't it? Except <laughs> he had a good chance of stopping the score even while playing like this. Hey. Wow, he didn't make a three dice with the Ulf. <laughs> what a mad bastard. Why didn't he make it a three dice with the Ulf? Oh, because maybe he'd go too near the tree. Maybe scared of the tree. Oh, this Falun's. Sad times. <laughs> Two fucking bribes. This is how I imagined the ducky game to go. Not him ignoring the ball, but you know, huge gang fouls every turn. Can't even stall now if it makes us GFI. Yeah, it's it's the it's the right decision, I think, to play like this. Yeah, shit, this is probably the best way to play, yeah. No, no gym fouls here, is there? Just fucking Yeah, it, it's really annoying when they don't roll rides and they don't knock cars. <laughs> um But, what can you do? I guess I've just got a score now. Which I guess he's only got three turns to score, so he... And if I can go into the half time at 1-0 up, and then I can just score quickly and go 2 0 up with basically no players I can score, can't I, for the one turn? So, if I go 2 0 up, maybe there's half a chance. But his fouls need to fucking calm down in their effectiveness, <laughs> for sure. Yeah, let him score. Well, I, I mean, I might be able to turn him over. Um, but yeah, I might be able to. He could score and could still one turn. Yeah, could one turn on him. Two one up and then go three one up. It should be, should be hard to lose from there. Could go for another sack, especially with strip. Still got a stripper there. Four rerolls for three turns, not bad. I 
That's true, but killing is how the Norse are going to win, isn't it? So... It's not even, like, the wrong strategy. Wow. Rolling double skulls is the wrong strategy, though. Yeah, you should roll pals like that. Well done. Much better. See, now he gets to hit with, with Frenzy, guys. And he gets to 2D the tree, whereas the other setup stopped him doing that. Just did not don't have the players to do it this time. Oh, honestly, what one stuck here and just the dirty player, I was like, oh my god, Ava. this is exactly what I expected. A foul. Big gang fouls and you know, wasn't good. Obviously, don't use, so he's got less assists on the foul. Otherwise, he'd foul the tree and kill the tree. He feels the pickup here. Be interesting, won't it? What I'd like here is a, a, a send off in both bribes failing, please. No. I mean, the sad thing is, you still got loads of scoring threats. So if I went, if I go crazy for the ball, he can just he can just score, can't he? Could go for a leap, one dice on the ball. He can foul wherever. I just don't think a leap, one dice on the ball is that good. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have done safe moves first. Fuck. Maybe I just scream. Ish. No, Kyle Duda, there was no way to blitz, was there? I don't have the players available <laughs> to make a blitz. <laughs> Fucking hell. Yeah, kicked. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, Kyle Duda. That's why I said it was a shame I didn't do it. But I, I didn't. Yeah, I shouldn't. I shouldn't. It wasn't a safe move, was it? Because I'd roll for it. So I absolutely should have done it last. So I thought standing a player up was a safe move, but obviously a tree man 
Standing up isn't a safe move, so I shouldn't have done it. Oh wow, he rolled it. He rolled a dice and failed. That was that was nice of him, wasn't it? Move him first. Yeah. Going for this one's first is better. Right, you can just stand on the dirty player at least, or you could dodge out to here. Can you get around one, two, three, four, five, six? You can crash in though. Right, blitz. <laughs> Need to make a blitz. Ha <laughs> ha glorious. <laughs> get fucked, little man. <laughs> Oh man, the tree's pretty good. Right, let's see if we use dodge. Dodge is used, so... And i still got to go this way to close off that. I still do one, one, one at a time. Right? Giving up a block at least means you can't foul with dirty player. That was pretty amazing, that wasn't it? Zero rerolls better make a GFI first action, yeah. I'm gonna talk about the fact he's gonna pay this guy. I didn't video in real time. I'm definitely, definitely not paying him. I certainly wouldn't be saying he's a good idea. Foul all my guys all the time. No. Just never get boring if you never fail anything. <laughs> um, well, you GH, I've failed a few things. Um, to be honest, failed especially the game that we drew. That was, oh, he's going to blitz that guy so he can make the dirty player foul. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> he's going to foul the tree. Of course he is. Got to go for the armor 10 guy when you can. Pretty good having a movement ten player, isn't it? Just, just quietly. I was thinking I was going to have to potato, and just didn't even need a potato. Just easily in range. Eighty-three percent. Oh man, that wasn't even all the assists. Ninety-two percent. Come on, double one. Come on, double one. Ah, shit. He did double one the armor. <laughs> Didn't double one the uh, the bribe, unfortunately. Right, so he can go there. He 
you can go here. <laughs> I can hit the hit the dirty player. Come on, kill him. Oh no, he aborted. He's <laughs> yes, get banged on. <laughs> uh, it doesn't get much more fun than that, does it? 2 0 up, receiving, and his, his dirty player's gone. Wow. <laughs> oh, backyard door door. <laughs> yes. Oh man, that's brilliant that he's not, at least he's not making any more dirty player fouls. He might still be making multi-assist fouls, but at least they're not dirty player fouls. Three, six, seven, eight players isn't even that bad, is it, for Elvis? Half tempted to go for the one turn here. Just because it kills the game, doesn't it? Hmm, <laughs> yes it is. <laughs> yeah, quick score. I'm tempted to go for a one turn. Just because, you know, I can blitz him for a push. And then go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It's only 3 GFIs, isn't it? In fact, I can blitz him for a ball down with Wrestle. I can put him there anyway and then see what happens. Just see what happens. Might go for it. Could blitz him for a push. Well, not even a push, a both down. Three dices him, two dices him, gets in, blitzes. Bob, Bob's your uncle. The only thing is, I've got to make three two pluses if I go for the one turn, and that's the thing, isn't it? So I'm not sure I want to. <laughs> thanks Tony yeah I really do want to show your feet yeah. no perms no thanks God I'm gonna go for it, aren't I? What a dickhead. <laughs> what a pure fucking dickhead here. 
I go there then if I fail the handoff there's protection. Oh, he's got catch. Fuck it, I just should have stack them all. <sighs> Didn't like doing that. Didn't like doing that. Just click the end zone. <laughs> All right, three nil up. The game is definitely safe. So now I can be hundred percent as safe as possible with the two good remaining players. <laughs> Fucking one turn. <laughs> I didn't like it. I mean, it was, you know, it was fucking risky, wasn't it? It was risky as fuck, especially stacking them. It was risky as fuck. I still don't, he could still pitch clear us even without the dirty player, so. I think just use the movement to lim min minimize blocks and stuff. Is the, uh, is the play. I am the guy, I was just really, really incredibly lucky. Yeah. <laughs> 30 bob is always getting banged on. It's a hard life being a line elf. And also, like, I was kind of dictating it, wasn't it, on my drive? Maybe I should have stalled it out. Yeah, pro tips would also have movement 10. And have played 9 games when everyone else has played, like, 3. That would be amazing, conceding and winning 3 too. Uh, yeah, don't use. Because he might go for a big foul. Oh, shit. Timber. Thick skull keeps him on. Fucking hell. <laughs> Thing is, if he scores, I can just one turn again as well. So it's not even like he can. He's got a valid route in of scoring three this half. It's like he could score three potentially. Make thick skull optional. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, because it's a strength skill, isn't it? If it was extraordinary, you might not have it the choice to use it. No, because that's, that's bollocks. Ignore that. You still make the fouls. He's not letting the dirty first stop him. Three stuns. Three stuns and a kill on the other ones. Fuck so. I'm being octopus, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> it's the same it's the same thing as catch isn't it like you you couldn't tell fucking Jerry Rice not to catch a ball could you you know so he would just catch it That's how you do it, you fucking prick. <laughs> oh, brilliant.
He's got this straight run here, but he, I don't think he can get assists in very easily. <laughs> Indeed, T Swizzle, but do you remember do you remember when that guy tried to not score against the Patriots? <laughs> he, like, he, he held it and he, he was obviously told not to score and he's just like, fuck it, I can't help it and just scored anyway. He's kind of like fell backwards or something, didn't he, with the ball? I remember it. I did as well, World King, to be honest, but... Um... I mean, this game hasn't has been pretty brutal, but only badly hurts, so not even bad so far. Still got the apple available. Going better than some orc games have gone. <laughs> Could leap in, but that seems dumb. Get in, get in your cage. <laughs> He's still a scoring threat. <laughs> so dumb. Yeah, eight one before this year. <laughs> Lil Baz remains un completely unkillable. <laughs> well, I think if anyone gets firmed, it's brown hair. <laughs> I'd rather he didn't get burned though. Well done. I guess if I double won the uh the GFI but then still he'd still he still gotta make his way to the end zone. Which isn't easy. So I still think the one turn isn't such oh god, these fucking KO rolls have been horrific. He might try to stop the one turn now somehow. I'm not sure he really can. <laughs> you can see his brain struggling with it. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, 
up to him, man. Right. So a block there, and then a block to there, and then it's just walk through the here, isn't it? Three dice. Push him to there if it's a push. Block him. And then straight through the middle. Brilliant. I guess I should try to chain him, seeing as I was actually going for it, yeah. But I mean, I didn't have to go for it, do I? That's the thing, I can set up like this and not go for it. Whereas, when you set up to do grabs or whatever, um, then you kind of have to go for it, don't you? Look at me playing like a complete shithead. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? <laughs> In Aryan sad. Chaos come back. Do these stay out again? Yep. <laughs> Fucking hell. Three, four, five, six, GFI, GFI. Let's not have them be baseable. I like how there's been five touchdowns and that guy has stayed KO'd through all of them. <laughs> he just doesn't give a fuck. <laughs> I could still lose by not being able to set up players though, that's the thing. Riot. Did, was that loser gain? I can't. Doesn't matter, does it, I guess. Um, I don't know, Thor. Let's let's have a check. Squirrel dude is the one who's just who's just taken a nap for the entire game. Harry Koo hasn't recovered either. Frumple bits just badly hurt. I think Thor badly hurt. I think, and Jam Toast was badly hurt by the uh, by the whiz. No, is it J5? Is that true? Yeah. Lost a turn's good then, yeah. I may turn with natural sprint, yeah. Don't use. 
Reroll it. He wants to take down the tree. Can't get no lose any time. All right, fair enough. Be so. I thought it was. Are you sure? Because I'm not. <laughs> Give it a week or two. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Give it a week or two. I'm only loving it because my team's ridiculously overpowered compared to everything. With a huge TV advantage. Yeah, it is it's definitely one disastrous game away. For sure. Now I'm going to get the ball here though, I think. Oh. Actually can't believe something failed. Literally can't. I'm shocked that something failed. <laughs> oh, for sure I'm just going to get the ball there. coming for us now. Shit. He's realised there's more else to hit. Yeah, I love stats to be fair. Yeah, the clangers, it's crazy, isn't it? They really do. They really do obsess about the tree. It's crazy. You go movement ten. <laughs> oh, it's ridiculous. He's a scoring threat there as well, just quietly. Yeah, indeed, Ducky. Yeah, that, yeah. Putting it on the ground is is really good. So that's true. Not making it three dice, but then re-rolling when you don't get a knockdown seems suboptimal to say the least. Indeed, yes, Clang is here. <laughs> brown hair. <laughs> it's really just calling him brown hair. <laughs> no! 
No! Don't badly hurt my tree! <laughs> Finally uses... Oh, he failed! <laughs> Good scoring! <laughs> it's, not, it's not even unlikely. Oh, holy shit. Like, it's not even unlikely, but look, let's be sensible. If I could be serious for a minute. It will lead to three LOS blocks. Don't the Kellis just wants to run? <laughs> Jeez. It'd been really funny to get a fifth, but um, would literally have achieved nothing. If I was sensible, I'd be playing cross eyes in there. Don't deserve to play with it. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> the scoring level, it may be, to be honest. Yeah, 49. Scoring would have leveled him. Could have gone for the score. <laughs> Judge Brown hair of the mob. That's what I should have done. That's what I should have done. <laughs> yeah, that would have been really good to go for the 5-1. It would have been funny. Would have leveled him as well, so there would have been a point. But, you know, every GFI he makes is a chance to die, isn't it? So, well, every GFI he attempts is a chance to die. So, well, one in three is not even spell. He uses Blitz, used as far, hasn't he? I pull that. ha <laughs> ha. Well done, Norse kill team. You killed nothing. <laughs> it's a pretty great celebration, to be fair, the Norse one. 4 2. Could have been 5 1, couldn't it? Really, but. Never mind. You know, if that war answer had failed to fucking dodge in and uh, been, you know, he'd have been gang fouled, he could have died. I mean, the tree was cast. So, could have been, could have been a kill. You never know. Reroll a one. Alright. Ooh, a touchdown away from from Rodge. Interesting, 20 AV breaks. But then obviously loads of fouls, weren't there? Made loads of dodges, I feel, that game. Oh, didn't, didn't even roll that well. <laughs> stop game, <Kevin. laughs> I tell you what, Hippie will, not, will never stop removing your entire team. I know that from experience. Um, so I've got the 12 players. I guess go down to 150 and then, and then think about next game, about doing something. Like either upgrading the stadium or getting a thrower or something. Right. Pretty good, isn't it? Touchdown away from levelling again. <laughs> For like sidestep, I guess. Not oh, sure feet, obviously sure feet. Obviously sure feet first. And then 76 sidestep. Some touchdowns for Senai to get sidestep. Two touchdowns for Svaho to get sidestep. And then a touchdown for Mama Bosco to get a... Uh, yeah, dodge. Clearly. Right. 
pretty pretty good. Yeah, get another concede would, would be would be ideal, obviously. Um Alright, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.